Jay, you're, you get this news. I had about an hour to process it. W what's been your reaction to what we learned today? Well, in one regard, I'm surprised. In another regard, I'm not. Uh, this case was – the NCAA never had a case here against North Carolina. While this was academic fraud from an accreditation standpoint, the rules uh, – the NCAA rules and bylaws do not cover this, and intentionally so. Uh, the presidents years and years ago intentionally said the NCAA was to stay out of their curricula, stay out of their uh, academic rigor, the conferring of degrees in majors and the like. So this has never been – academic fraud under NCAA rules, and North Carolina was never charged with academic fraud. So the, the surprise here is that the NCAA Committee on Infractions would go through this long process that has been a colossal waste of time and resources, only to reach the conclusion that many of us said at the beginning uh, should be the case. There was no case here. And, and similar things, in, in fact, uh, the exact same thing happened at Michigan. Uh, eight years ago, and it happened at Auburn. It's just that they weren't a, a, as lengthy uh, of issues of academic impropriety. But the NCAA didn't even bring a case in, in those, those instances because the rules don't cover it. And, and that's what happened here. And, it, it, again, it was a colossal waste of time and resources by the NCAA to even bring a case when they knew from the beginning the rules didn't cover this.